How can you create your free online website using Google Sites and enable a shop feature using Equid? Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you guys how you can create your own website using Google Sites and because it doesn't provide a shopping platform on the website itself, how you can integrate Equid to your Google site so you can enable a shopping feature. So let's get into it. First off, you're going to go on sites.google.com and you can just search that on Google. You probably have your account logged in and then you're going to click on the blank at the top left. So once you do that, this is going to be your basic dashboard where you're going to start designing your website and adding your content. So over here on the right, you can see there are text boxes, you can add images, you can embed some kind of file, you can add stuff via your Google Drive. You can also change the layout of your website. So if you want to move your title over here, the image over here, or whatever kind of customization you want. Below that, you have your collapsible text, your table of contents, your image carousel, your buttons, dividers, placeholders, YouTube clips, calendars, maps, docs, slides, sheets, forms, all of these simple things you can simply insert by just clicking on them. Next up, you will have your pages. So if you want to add any more website pages, you can add them from here. And after that, you have your theme. So over here, you can customize the text, color, style of your website. So you can just change that and change the coloring, whatever kind of color scheme you want to follow. So just to show you guys how to get your design up and running, I'm going to design a random website. So I'll just welcome to our store. Let's change the design a bit. Let's change the color. Let's go for pink because as you guys might know by now, I really do like pink. Yeah, th this shade seems good. And then you can also change the font style you want to follow in within this specific template. So let's just keep it to a classic. You can see the heavy looks like this, but it looks overall too bold and too unbalanced with the overall look. So we're going to go with the classic. Then we can change our layout. We can add any kind of image. So let's upload a image from our computer's gallery. I'm just going to select one of these random images. I have no clue what, which one it is. Oh, it's an image of a dress. And over here, you're going to add any kind of title or description you want. So let's just say, and then we're going to say, chore in a box and then below that let's just insert a divider and then we are going to add some collapsible text so let's just say categories and then you are going to add dresses below that let's just you can add charts and forms if your website is based on more analytical stuff I'm just going for fashion. Next up, I'm going to just add a image carousel. So you might've seen this on other websites. There are a couple of images and they are running around in a circle when you place your cursor on them. So that is very appealing. And this is a great feature provided by Google Sites because this looks very, very intricate. And if you are uh, going for a design-based website, if you're related to fashion and whatnot, this is very um, pretty to have. So I'm just going to move this to the center of the page. And you can see over here that these are going to be three images that are going to be displayed once you place your cursor on them. Uh, this kind of design is actually quite popular these days. Everyone um, is using them in their home pages because it is so appealing and it uh, usually garners so much information and is able to execute so much that uh, traditional imagery would not be able to do. So once you've designed your website, let's just say our brand name is Lolly the Fashion. So once you've designed your website, uh, well, how are you going to actually sell your products via uh, Google Sites? Well, for that, you will have to actually go to Equid. So I'm just going to hop on to Equid and I'm going to show you guys what the Equid platform is like. 
over here you can see Equid is a free to use uh, online e-commerce store and I think if you're using your Google Sites platform Equid is a great integration to make. You can also use Shopify but Shopify is something you will have to pay for and if you're just getting started out you might want to opt for Equid. I'm just going to show you guys how to start up with Equid also. You're going to click on get started for free. You're going to put in your details and I'll catch you guys once I put in mine. So once you have logged into your Equid control panel, this is going to be your basic dashboard and on the left you can see many options. Over here you're going to add your product catalog and all other details. Uh, I have previously posted a tutorial on how to get started on your Equid e-commerce store and how to add products and how to set up your account on Equid. So make sure to watch that if you need any more help with Equid. And on the left you will see your overview and you're going to go into that and you can see sell on your website over here you can see there isn't a direct option to directly sell on uh, google sites but you're just going to click on either custom website or other platforms and site builders so i'm just going to click on custom website and you are going to copy this code so you're going to select all of it and then you are going to copy it and now what you're going to do is go back to your google site over here you can see and on the right side you will see insert and below that is embed you are going to embed your copied code so make sure you go by the embed code not the url you're going to paste that you're going to click on next and you are going to insert that so over here you can see the default products that are available on our website are actually showing up and whatever you have actually added to your actual equid website will show up here and you can move this block around so if you want to place it down below if you want to keep it at the top so people can get easy access to your store. You can do that. You can make it smaller or whatever kind of customization you might require for uh, your personal uh, website. So just to summarize with you guys, uh, now you guys can easily create a website using Google Sites. So you're going to do that for free. And because Google Sites does not have its inbuilt e-commerce platform, you're going to use Equid to sell your products. And on Equid, you will get your uh, product details, your basic business details are going to be present on Equid. So on Equid, you'll see sales, your catalogs, your products and all that stuff. And you can also import it to Google Docs or import the data that you have already entered on Google Docs to Equid. And that is how you will get all set up on Google Sites or Equid and have your platforms separated so your website team can be separated and it can work on google sites only and your analytical team your marketing team your advertisement team can focus on the equid platform and take a look at the more uh, nitty-gritty stuff and the details and whatnot so your it your designers can work on Google Sites while the rest of the team that's related to the marketing and analytics can actually work on Equid. So that's another benefit of using them separately if you have separate teams for the, both of these operations or else you can opt for certain website builders that do both of these things. However, I don't think this is actually a bad combination using Google Sites and Equid for your e-commerce platform. So I hope you guys found this video helpful and I will catch you guys in the next video.